What's up guys, I'm back with another reaction video and today we are reacting to another boxing video, you feel me? We had so much fun on that last Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury, the third fight, you feel me? I had to get into another fight of the year campaign, you feel me? Well, in my head, I don't know what y'all think, you feel me? But, like I said, man, uh, I was about to actually say something else, but then I got distracted, but listen. Guys, disclaimer, before the video starts, I am not a boxing expert, professional, amateur, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I'm a boxing fan. This is my opinion. Take it with a grain of salt, you feel me? Ah, uh, ah, uh, just enjoy the video with me. La da da yada. Yo, guys, if y'all don't like pausing, <laughs> you feel me? If something heat happens in the fight, I'm pausing. I'm talking about it. I, I'm like a fight breakdown. I like to watch film, break it down, all that good stuff. So if y'all don't like pausing, get the fuck up out of here. Skedaddle. Y'all already know. If y'all watch my videos, y'all know how I go. I'm excited to get into this video, so I'm rushing through this, bro. So, without further ado, Canelo versus Caleb Plant. Now, look, before we start this shit now, right? I fucks with Canelo, heavy. And I fucks with Caleb Plant, heavy. I like both styles. Now, Canelo, you feel me, is unbeatable right now. I'm not a Canelo, like... Like, oh, Canelo this, Canelo that. You know, there's some, like, boxing fans that think, like, Canelo's, like, a god in the sport. Look, every dog has his day, you feel me? Canelo has lost once. He can most definitely get beaten again. But right now, nobody's fucking with Bull. You understand me? So, Caleb Plant, in his own respect, he's on his way, you feel me? And when this, fought, when this fight was announced, I was hyped because for the fans and for all that boxing, it's good and shit. Because we like to see the best fight the best. But, me personally, I knew... I, I, me personally, I was like, yo, Canelo gonna win because Caleb don't got the experience. He just ain't fight the same fighters that Canelo fought. He just don't, just don't got the experience like Canelo, you feel me? And that's why I thought, and I thought Canelo power was gonna be a big difference. Well, this fight, I have seen the highlights when it first came out, you feel me? And Caleb Plant most definitely proved me wrong. He was boxing beautifully before whatever happened, happened. And... I think it was a good fight. I was never able to watch. Like, I did say I watched the highlights. What I mean by that is, like, what they was available on YouTube at the time. Because, you know, when the fight just comes out, if it's pay-per-view, you get limited highlights. So, I was just seeing the knockout and shit like that. But, we got a hold of a full 9 minutes and 18 seconds. I don't know who put this out. Let me give him a little shout-out real quick. Um, who was this? Air Highlights. Air Highlights. They got a little highlight clip. Everybody in the comments was saying this is the best highlight reel. So now we about to get a little more deep into the analyzing. So let's get straight into this. You feel me? Cool shit. Let's rock out. Be my command. Oh, let me try to put the... No, this is the best it's going to get. Quality wise. Let's, let's see. There's got to be some substance behind it because Canelo also... Caleb Plant will mm. have to throw a very okay. guns blazing in the early So we knew Caleb was boxing throughout the early rounds. Good jab. Keeping Canelo out. But Canelo's the type of person he likes to download what you're doing. So it's like, he will let you throw those jabs. Let you throw that. So he can see what your openings are. Like, small fighter. Ooh. That, that down. That chopping down shot. Hold on, let me say something. So we all know Caleb Plant get knocked out, right? Uh, uh, and I seen that the shot that put him down was like a chopping right hand. And it seems like Canelo's been hitting that from this round one. And he's throwing that same shot. So I don't know if he was throwing that shit the whole fight and set him up for that shot. But it's crazy like how you catch certain patterns and shit. So let's see. Ooh, good shit, good shit. I noticed Caleb is boxing with the shoulder roll. Are we gonna have more here in the second? Plan boxing with the shoulder roll. He fighting behind that jab well though. I ain't gonna lie. He's good. Mm. He's catching the left too. Ooh! That was a good quick response. That yeah, chopping right. Good body catch. Good shit. Good catch. Frustrates his opponent, maybe Danny Jacobs when he stood to what Golovkin did. Ooh, this is good work. Nah, bro. Bro, this is good work. Like, Caleb was working first two rounds. This is good work. Canelo, I ain't saying like, yo, he getting blown out. Like, Canelo is still dead. But I'm saying just like with Canelo, you got to frustrate him a little bit. Make, make him feel as if he can't hit you. So he start coming and taking little chances. Like, He's doing good so far. It's like he's fighting like the European style. Hit, step back, shoulder roll, move, step back. The shit, ooh, you gotta move with that left. Canelo too strong for you to stay there, Caleb. 
Plant trying to utilise that big reach advantage. Gradually walks his opponents down. And that's really in Plant's favour. That uppercut caught him a second chopping. time. Good composure by Canelo too though, because he's not getting too frustrated right now. He's just trying to still download, homie, figure out what the openings are. Ooh, good body. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Don't stay on the ropes. When you on the ropes, Canelo unload. That boy got tackled. All right, guys, so technical difficulties happen. You feel me? My camera just died. You feel me? We switched the battery, all that good stuff. So, I don't know what was the last thing I said, but I had paused it when it died, so it looks like we right here. Let me just rewind it like 10 seconds. I know I was talking about the way how um, Canelo throws his body shots. I was saying, like, in the first beginning rounds, Caleb Plant, he was boxing beautifully, right? He was keeping Canelo at... Now, I wouldn't say at bay because Canelo was still there, but he was most definitely throwing the jabs to make Canelo second guess just opening up and just throwing them wild power shots. So he was boxing beautifully. But I'm starting to notice by round three, Canelo started throwing more combinations. What I like about Canelo gaming, bro, just don't headhunt, bro. He's strong enough to knock your ass out, but he know, like, I could break this fighter down. So he body, he body hunting. And it's like his body punches is like a, like a whipping. I can't do it. The chairs right here, like the whipping, like a whipping, like hit to the body. And that shit is catching Caleb. So I can see, um... Hopefully, he don't get hit with too much of those. Well, I don't know if he do, but that shit could wear some, a fighter down, period. So, let's see like that. But, 21 and... I just see Caleb's playing record right here. He's 21 and old, 12 knockouts. He don't look like a person that carries super power. Super... Like, too much power, but it looked like he's sharp enough where Canelo's still like, oh, oh, because we seen Canelo get hit with some shit. I ain't gonna lie. So is Caleb. Hard to detect. So, yeah. And again, he's having okay, so he just hit him with that body shot I was talking about. Good boxing. You see what I'm talking about? Like, it's not strong to where it's going to back Canelo up, but it's strong enough to... It's sharp enough to... You feel me? Sharp enough to put the head back. Look at that, Canelo. You see? Head, head, body. Good combination. You've got to hold your feet, especially on the ropes. Good uppercut, Canelo know how to fight, bro. Ooh, good, right? Mm-hmm. Ooh, that body. What I like about Canelo, too, is like, I don't, for a boxer, you don't got to hit the body. Like, if you go for the body, even if they guard it, sometimes hitting their hands is good, too. Wear to hold everything down. Punch wherever you can hit. Shoulders, thing. Everything that wears a fighter down, you feel me? It does. Both men will be confident in the way that contest is going, and that can be fun. Stop! Anytime Bro, they you catching the ads, but my son got to eat. I understand it, person. but not off me, nigga. We slipping out. Let's get it. Very explosive from the chat in this round. Look at that! Canelo punches a straight load up. I love it though. Caleb is still trying to like keep that shoulder roll, but that jab is not looking so stiff out there like how he. Nah, he's still doing the jab. I don't want to talk about it. Mm. He ca Caleb is catching them. A lot of the lefts, he's catching them on, on his guard. I'm just wondering whether whether attacks in that round. Canelo got a good, a good body attack and head attack. He's mixing it up so well. Good work from Plant. Good mix-up. Good shit. When Caleb was against that ropes, Canelo eats. Brings the shoulder round. Ditch the head. The how to cope with this man. Ooh. No more shots. He's better than Canelo. The Plant's holding Ooh, his face. Ooh, Caleb. Oh, that's... That, that. I don't know if that's his right hand or his left hand, but that shit chopping down is crazy. And again, he's getting closer and closer. And Plant's feet up for the big Yeah, Canelo is getting closer and closer. And closer. Like, his jab is connecting off, more. Off, off, off. He could get to the head a little bit more. Yeah. Caleb is keeping the composure well, though. Especially for a fighter that hasn't been at this big magnitude of fighting like a Canelo or something like that. The composure as well. He's just in the zone. The confidence building in. So it's all, it's very important. It's a good job. Again, Alvarez coming forward. No respect thrown into it. Got to put something behind those jabs. Forward. A nice right hand counter. Oh, watch those. Has he got the physical strength and the power? Caleb leans down to the right a lot too, and that's why Canelo's coming. Surely this is the cat and the mouse and Alfred. 
Cass good job, good job. aside. Things are being thrown from him. I really think there may be some, something wrong, but... It went from the, the highlights went from Canelo back against the ropes. And then all of a sudden, Caleb just there. Like, what happened in the between? Like, how is Switch? Canelo the type of nigga that lets you put him up against the ropes just so he could let you download the drip and hit you from off the ropes. Like, he... He a good all-around fighter, bro. I ain't gonna lie. And he got way better now. Alright, y'all, look. Camera keeps get overheating, so it wasn't even the batteries. The camera overheating, so that's why I keep shutting off. This video is 9 minutes and 18 seconds, and we're 5 minutes through. I gotta shut the fuck up and just go straight through. So, no more pausing, y'all. Let's just get... Let's just finish this video before this shit overheat. But this is a good-ass fight, though, and I can't rush greatness, so it's like, ah, you know what I mean? No, let's just go. On the inside, look, just some left -up combination. Um, it's a testing night as long as Plank keeps uh, bringing yeah, Good body hits, cool. Hey, guys, Leeks is here, about to hand me a little, fill me a little drink, but listen. <laughs> We gonna have her come and react to some of these fights with me because Leeks is all, watch all the fights with me and all that shit. She fucks with boxing too, so we gonna have her come next video, all right? All right. That's a fair job of avoiding that right but out. yeah, y'all see, so this nigga Canelo, he was doing that good um combination hand. I feel like a lot of, uh, that's a lot of players. A lot of fighters, when they fight against Canelo, they don't body, they don't hit this nigga body at all. Like that. And I understand why nobody wants to open up, try to hit Canelo body and get caught in the freaking jaw in the process, but body hunting Canelo too would be, you gotta slow him down. That niggas, that niggas are, mmm, look at those. Mm. I ain't gonna lie, I love the pressure of my son Canelo, bro. He's on him. He like, yo, bro, I'm taking them hits because my Caleb is out here swift boxing too, but I'm like, I'll take one and just throw some shit. Alright, good combo, bro. <laughs> yo. Mm. Oh, goodness. Mike Tyson, my favorite fighter right there. Let me get go. Yeah, big shots going in for both boxers now. Missed there with that. Slow those feet down. This is the 10th round, too. Caleb, yo, bro. Caleb a good fighter, bro. He's gonna come back, bro. My dog right here under me, y'all. Y'all should see this shit. In the 10th round. And a lot of people thought it would have been you can see the confidence in him now. He's decided to stand it. Good body hit. Oh, good send the hit. He hitting that boy. That boy body on the left side, right there in the left. That whipping shit. Good body, good body, wearing him down. You want to be a great all-around fighter, bro? You really going to have to learn how to get that body work just as good as that head work, bro. Good shit. Oh, oh! You see the setup though. The setup was the body, then head hunt. Oh, Caleb is my nigga. I don't like to see him go down like that. But that chopping down is what put him down too. And he was getting hit with that before. That's it of the highlights, right? Mm. Respectfully. And mind you, I'm not even gonna hold you. That wasn't even a bad. It wasn't even a bad knockout. Like you feel me? Like. He gonna be, yo, and this is, yo, let me pause it right now, talking about shit right now. Listen, the reason why the best be discouraged from fighting the best is because niggas don't like taking L's, and sometimes when they get, when they do take their first L or take L's, period, the fans switch up, and I, I discourage fighters, you feel me? At the end of the day, fighters, entertainers, whatever the case may be, you feel me? We all humans at the end of the day, and we don't like to feel like we letting down niggas, and we don't want to let ourselves down type shit, so it's like... Some of these fighters, they take their L's, and you feel me? And some of these niggas don't, they, they, they mental take a, they, they take a L, and they mental take a L too, because them niggas go down, you feel me? Niggas get depressed, don't want to fight no more, they just don't fight with that same confidence. I'm going to tell you this, bro. Canelo the best nigga right now, you feel me? Getting knocked out by that nigga is nothing to be ashamed of. Not only that, he was putting up a great fight before the demise type shit. So me personally, I feel like Kate. Caleb Plant need to get back up on that bicycle. Keep working, because he's a great fighter, bro. Keep working. He gonna get the championship back. And I ain't gonna lie. 
You feel me? If Caleb started getting the um experience he had, like he started gaining his experience, maybe fight like David Benavidez, fight Jamal Charlo or Jamel, whichever one is at 160, you feel me? And I used, like I told you, I don't be correct all the time, but you feel me? Fight the one at 160, like start fighting these other top names, and if he could beat them niggas and then come back and fight Canelo, that'll be a fight I would want to watch. That'll be a way better fight after he gained the experience. So my camera shut off again. My dog is right under me while I was doing the reactions. She's just here playing. Respectfully though, let me just try to get off what I was saying because it's the close up of the video anyway. Like I was saying, um, Caleb is a great fighter. When he gains the experience, this is a fight I will most definitely want to see again because he was holding his own. And yeah, he can most definitely bounce back. So hopefully bro don't feel discouraged. Uh, uh, Canelo, that motherfucker, it, we already know how great he is right now. I, I, I'm glad that he evolved even after that Floyd fight because we see a little bit of mistakes of him. Like, yo, he needs to mature after that Floyd fight, and he most definitely matured and took on that crown, took that shit, you feel me? He's an all-around good fighter. Canelo got defense. He got fucking offense, most definitely. But he got combination punches. It's not like he just straight head hunting. My boy will body hunt, da da da. Like, you gotta be worried. He got power. He could take a punch. Stamina. All those shits come into play, bro, to be a good fighter, you feel me? So, yeah, bro. That was a great fight to watch. And if you guys ain't see my Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder reaction, that was another great fight to watch. So, go check that out if y'all ain't see that. Yeah, y'all. It's the end of the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share. Comment what you want your boy to react to next. And most importantly, subscribe and join the gang, 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 gang. It's your boy Jay, and I'm out.